Hello, Bajo Shalom. Shalom. And welcome to Culture Buzz. Hi. One of Israel's finest sopranos. Thank you. A brilliant performance a few days ago as the Be'er Sheva Sinfonietta opened its 40th season. Very exciting. So how did this uh, love affair with <laughs> the Southern Israeli Symphony Orchestra happen? Well, I already started to sing with them uh, while I was still a student, so it's always nice to be back now as a professional singer. Last year I was invited to open the season to sing The Creation by Haydn. And unfortunately we came to the hall and the first uh, night for the opening grand uh, opening of uh, the season and uh, Beersheva was bombed. The neighbors misbehaved <laughs> again? <laughs> Our friends were a bit, you know, disturbing the area but of course uh, we couldn't uh, sing that, that night so they cancelled the concert. Um, I'm very happy that I was invited again to open this season and now this actually this year we managed to, to start the first concert and to sing and I really hope it's going to go to this direction a very peaceful area. Hila, you have reached a certain stage mm -hmm. in your career. It seems that you don't have to prove anything to anyone anymore but I'm guessing it wasn't easy. It was a long, long road. But you, what do you mean it was? It's still. Still? It's always. It's, a, it's always a long road. I believe that in art, especially in singing, um, I always have to be better. Now. We change physically also. So we always have to work uh, to main, maintain our voices. And um, singing is a very hard work when you don't sing with microphone. And that's the, right. the idea of right. singing classical music, singing opera. But how demanding has it been for you growing up? Super demanding. Since, uh, since I was 10, I sang in the children's choir Uncool. in Jerusalem. Uncool. In Uncool, of course. And it was six days a week, three hours every day. So wow. I didn't have a really like an like athlete. A normal child. Like an athlete. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. Exactly. Because it's a, it's a muscle. You have to train the muscle. Voice, why why singing? Why not playing an instrument? You know, I played piano. While I was playing the piano, I always sang. So, the, the piano teacher told my mom, maybe you should, um, you should uh, take her to sing in the children's choir because she likes singing, actually. She doesn't like playing in the piano. Thank you, mother. Yeah, thank you, mother. So, it was a natural way for me. and. Then, of course, when I was in high school, I wanted to be different and not to do at all classical music. I came back to this after the army, after seven years. How is opera life in Israel? Um, there's the Israeli opera, of course. It's actually the only opera house we have. So, um, it's, it's very good. It's international. Um, it gives stage to the Israeli singers. Thank and you, Hana. Uh, thank you for Hana. Thank you for many people there who support. Um, th there's never enough job, of course, here. Uh, that's why we always have to perform abroad. Perform outside, yeah, to sing outside and to go. And of course, it's also part of our uh, will and part of our wish is to sing uh, internationally in opera houses around the world. Yeah. The differences between Israeli audience. Israeli opera audience and audiences abroad? Well, you, you can bring the Israeli audience, the lousiest sing singer ever, and they will never boo him. I was in Italy and I saw performances also in Germany. Well, I wasn't singing, but I was on, in the audience. And people scream boo if they don't like someone. Uh -huh. So here in Israel, they're quite polite. Amazing. Amazing. Surprising. Surprising. <laughs> there is hope. Yeah. <laughs> If I, your, some of your favorite roles, mm -hmm. roles you are dying to sing. Yeah, well, I think this year definitely one of them was Gilda in Rigoletto. Uh -huh. um, I, also, I, I, I still want to sing many, many roles, of course. Uh, Manon, Massenet, I like French operas. Um, one of the best things I did on stage, I think, was The Child. In Hanoch Levin? Hanoch Levin, yeah. In Germany? 
And in Israel. In Germany and in Israel. We did it in Wiesbaden and also in Israel. Music and by Gil Shochat? It was by Gil Shochat. And it was, for me, a very good stage experience as an actress, actually. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah, because an opera singer is also an, an actress. Must be. Yeah. Must mm-hmm. be. What can we wish Hila Baggio for the future? <laughs> that I will manage to balance a career and family without to actually hurt each one of them, you know? So I think that's the best thing I can wish for myself. So we wish you that Thank and you much much. more. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Good luck and shalom.